cameras trained on one man in a rich vein of form and number one on the scoring charts. Can he do it again today, live on EA TV? And welcome, a fascinating match in prospect here at the VVK Arena. I'm Derek Ray, joined for commentary by former England international Lee Dixon. And the focus is on the Bundesliga. Live action coming up. It is Augsburg up against Hannover. Hi, right, Derek, thank you. Well, both managers will be reminding their players how important it is to start off the game really quickly. Really attack the opposition, put them on the back foot, see what comes of that. Hopefully we get a good game. Well, as you can see, the visitors come into this game full of confidence in front of goal. The best attack in the league statistically. Well, Derek, everything we do on a football pitch is all based around goals. Keeping them out, that was my job, a bit boring, I'll give you that. And scoring them. And boy, the top scorers, they very rarely let you down. I'm sure we're in for a load more today. It should be a goal fest. And now the starting 11 for Augsburg. Would you call it 4-5-1, Lee? Yeah, I really like this formation, Derek. 4-2-3-1, really. The two central midfield players supplying support to a three ahead of them and then a lone striker with a number 10 just behind him. Here's the starting 11 for Hannover. Vielen Dank, liebe Zuschauer, in der WDK Arena. Ich wünsche viel Spaß mit diesem Spiel. And the contest begins. Zeka. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. Could be a oh, tremendous block. Can they get in behind them? Now well, there to intercept. Juan Camilo Hernandez. And he might be through here. In it goes. An early goal. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, we can see here it's a good finish, but really it's all about the concerted pressure beforehand. Really disciplined, working as a team to force a mistake and regain possession high up the pitch. Then they take full advantage. 1 0 then. <laughs> Alenia. Mikael Damsgaard are showing good patience. Will they get themselves level here? Well, good defending, clattered out of there. High quality defending. Kedira. Juan Camilo Hernandez. And good use of advantage, the referee allowing play to continue. Referees are rightly praised for giving advantage, but when there is no advantage, it has to be a free kick. Jajic, and thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. I just missed that little bit of attacking spark. Goalkeeper's ball. Now successfully cut out. Chance to run at them possibilities inside the box a really vital interception a 
Effective pressure to regain possession. Jajic. Regain possession. Mikael Damsgaard. Miner. See some progress with the ball at his feet. Dangerous looking attack. Still could put it away. Well, no accuracy at all in terms of the shot unleashed. Well, it's the care and attention, all that work to get in the position and then way, way wide. Zeka. And he read it well. Good movement. Untidy in possession. Vargas. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw in. Iago. Zeka. It needs an accurate cross. Chances on. Well, nothing productive, really. Svanberg. Mikael Damsgaard. It's with Alenia. It might be on for them. Has a go, and it's in! All square again! What a match this is turning out to be! Well, as we see again here, this really is patient, accurate, incisive passing at its best. And when he gets through to the keeper, he just smashes it past him and gives him no chance to think. A lovely finish. Well, the manager must be delighted with his team after they showed that attitude to get back into this top stuff. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out, one apiece. And the emphasis is on creativity. Untidy on the ball. Good vision. Can he get onto this? Firing is in. Almost unbelievably, he's kept it out. Well, I'm not sure how he's reached that. Just look at the stretch on that. A brilliant save. Played into the centre of the box. Minor. Mikael Damsgaard. And fed forwards. Well, he didn't miss by an awful lot. Juan Camilo Hernandez. Kedira. Hernandez. Lovely ball over the top. Well, he has the measure of his opponent. Gives it a go. And it's in! The back in front. Stunning scenes here. Well, here's the replay, and it's an exquisite ball over the defence. And sometimes, with all the time in the world, you can fluff your lines. But he composes himself and slips it past the keeper beautifully. Well, 2-1 it is here.
Hanover certainly enjoying the lion's share of possession, but it's just whether they can convert that possession into clear-cut chances. You sense they need to pick up the pace a little, start utilising the wide areas more. The back line's doing a decent job. Hopefully the forwards can do that as well. And the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Alenia, Damsgaard, Svanberg, it did look on for them, but not to be. Marco Richter, really good reading of the game to win possession back. Damsgaard, moving it forward, committed challenge. Well, a reminder, we have more knocker, and he's through here. Sends it back. Save, but still a chance. Well, they've won possession back. What can they do from here? Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Mikael Damsgaard. Losing possession here. Iaich. Nice looking pass. Zeka. Great strong tackle. Throw in forthcoming. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Promising attack, this. A terrific defending to stop them progressing. Alenia. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. Intercepting it intelligently. And 30 minutes left for play in this match. Minor. Still behind, but the pressure mounting. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. Determined defending. Svanberg. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Eine wichtige Durchsage. Am kommenden Dienstag spielt er mit alten Herren. Das lohnt sich immer. Das sollten Sie sich nicht Svanberg. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Takes the shot. A goal. Real excitement. A back and forth type of game. Now they're level. Well, we see it again here, and the pace and accuracy of this passing is a dream. And still with lots to do, he unleashes a very powerful effort. Gave the keeper little chance. Lovely goal that was. Again here, this has been quite the roller coaster ride. Zeka. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. 
cross blocked. And firing it into the area. I must admit, I thought he was going to score with that header. Yeah, it was a quality cross and he gets up well and it's just wide. Svanberg. Damsgaard. Well, they'll be happy to have regained possession. Miner. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Mikael Damsgaard. Well, possibilities inside the box. Svanberg. Excellent passing. Well, he's beaten his man comprehensively. And a goal! He's doubled his total for the day in superb scoring form. Well, here it is again, and I wonder how he waltzes past the defender so easily. And when he gets through to the keeper, he just smashes it past him and gives him no chance to think. A lovely finish. Dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Inside the last quarter of an hour. Getting in there to intercept. Pedersen. Mikael Damsgaard. And possession given away. Well, Derek, just listen to that noise, doing everything they can to try and help the players out. Can they get this equaliser? Well, they haven't been at their best today, that's for sure, but this game is far from over. And the fact... A real opening now. Big chance. What late excitement. And the match is level. Well, here's the replay. He's done really well to get his head up and pick out a teammate. And a 2v1 is never fair. To be honest with you, the keeper's got no chance to stop this. It's lovely football. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. Svanberg. And news of a goal at the Borussia Park from Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Hertha. Six minutes remain. 1-0. Thanks very much as always, Alan. Can they push ahead on the closing stages? Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Pressing as a team. Slipshod passing. Adam Jaic. Counter-attacking, very much an option. This is why we adore this game. Late drama, and now they're in front. Well, it looks like the game is over, but no, there's another chance. And there it is, back of the net. It looks like the winner. Well, let's see the replay and look at the pace at which the counter-attack happens. And then the composer is impressive as he smashes the ball with all he has to beat a forlorn goalkeeper. Brilliant strike. Well, how about this? 4-3. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. And with that, the attack fizzles out. A corner kick, and who knows, this might represent their last chance to grab an equaliser. It's opening up for them. And successfully cut out. 
And that will be all for this game anyway. And defeat for the visitors. Lee, what did you make of it? Yeah, there was not much in it for most of the game. I'm sure they'll feel they deserved at least a point from that. It's obviously very disappointing to concede in the manner they did so late on. But they just have to bounce back now.